worry about the big crowd. Um, I really, I mean, my teammates helped me out a bunch. I mean, they were all fired up for me. And that's really how I got through it. I just focused on them and focused on the match, and that was it. Brandon, did you guys expect that you would be able to pull this thing out today? I mean, you're a higher seed. Uh, you know what? I knew that we had the talent on our team and we had the fight and heart. Um, it was just depending on how our team was going to handle the atmosphere. Um, for a lot of us, it was the most amount of people that we've ever played in front of before. And uh, I knew that if we could handle playing in front of such a big crowd and uh, just be able to block out all the noise, uh, we'd be able to come through with a win. Was there any point after he came back and won that second set that you know you had that you might have thought that things had changed a little bit for you guys, or did, were you just able to refocus on that third set? No, you know, um, I mean, I've lost a lot of sets before, that's for sure. Um, I know what to do, that's for sure. Um, I said stick to my game. I didn't execute as well as I would like to start in the second set, and uh, credit to him, he played he played a very good second set. But uh, I just had to fight. I was on him the whole way through the, through the third set. I knew eventually I was going to get my break. I was close in all of his service games. I just kept fighting, and uh, I knew it was going to come. Were you all surprised at how many North Carolina fans there were? I mean, there were a pretty good number of Carolina fans in that big crowd. Yeah, it was. Uh, they're pretty loud. Uh, I liked it. So that's, yeah, answer, that's for sure. I found that Carolina travels very well, and you have fans everywhere you go. And that's a credit to our university um, and all the alumni. They came out today, and uh, it was a big help. Um, Braden, you've only been in school for what three, four, four or five months. Or, you know, how does this compare to what kind of you were looking for from the college tennis experience? Um, it's unbelievable, that's for sure. It's totally different, and I love every minute of it. I love playing beside my teammates and my best friends now. Um, it's totally different than being out there alone, grinding the futures and challengers. Um, you're always by yourself, and here I have a team. And whether I win or lose, you know, I always have my teammates. They always have my back, I have their back. And uh, it's great to know that even though I can lose sometimes, my team can pull out the win. Coach, you've experienced the atmosphere before here at Georgia, obviously. Where, <coughs> what do you feel like y'all did to be able to overcome it this time? Um, well, I think we learned a lot, honestly, you know, as a coaching staff from the last time we were here two years ago. Um, and, uh, you know, you know again, we try to keep our guys loose, you know, and <coughs> focused on playing tennis. You know, last time, I think the crowd affected us a little bit, you know, in the night match we played at 7 o'clock. And, uh, you know, more credit to all these guys because I think it was a great crowd today, great atmosphere, and they embraced it, you know, all the way through. So I'm just really proud of my team. What was the, the key, do you think, for you guys being able to pull this thing out? Um, well, obviously, the doubles point, you know, gave us a lot of momentum. And I think, uh, you know, winning uh, four first sets, I think Jack Murray coming back at number five singles, I think that helped our momentum uh, quite a bit. You know, they were stepping on us pretty good down below. And then, uh, you know, we were able to hold on, you know, and turn it. So I also think, you know, again, you know, we've got a lot of alumni and some former players in Atlanta. You know, some parents that drove down from Raleigh and Chapel Hill, so I think that also helped us quite a bit, too. And obviously, you know, the local uh, Joe Frierson, you know, one of our former players, they live right up the street, so it's just great to always have his support here. Is Athens your favorite place to date on this tournament? Um, well, I've been coming here since 1977. Um, and, um, I'm telling the guys stories about watching back in red play and Eric Kaskursky and all those great players when I was in high school. Um, you know, honestly, like today, I'm looking up. It's one of the first, first time I've ever been here. Coach McGill wasn't here. You know, and it makes me really sad, to be honest with you, because what he's meant to college tennis and what he's done here in this atmosphere is just, uh, you know, incredible. And obviously, too, I mean, Manny's done an unbelievable job. You know, so, you know, we were fighting the Georgia team and the Georgia crowd today. And the, tradition that they have. So again, I'm just really proud of my team that they were able to focus and just play and go to work. Any other questions? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.